Welcome to a dramatic recreation of Paul Ferry's viral tweet essay, A Brief History of Nobody Wants to Work Anymore. One in five executive leaders agree with this statement. No one wants to work. But what has happened to the work ethic in America? Nobody wants to work anymore. When I was a teenager, I saw people work hard. I can't believe the bad luck I've had trying to find someone to do home improvements. It's almost like nobody wants to work anymore and when they do, they don't take pride in it. How do you find a dependable worker? What do you mean, what was I offering to pay them? Nobody wants to work anymore. They all want to work in front of a computer and make lots of money. Farming is my hobby now, but these rocks. I hired two boys to clear the rocks off this land last week and they just fooled around. They didn't want to work. Nobody wants to work anymore. Heard somebody say the other day that everybody was getting too darn lazy and nobody wants to work anymore. It's the truth if I ever heard it. Come down, you sound hysterical. I want to lower taxes. The trouble is everybody is on relief or a pension. Nobody wants to work anymore. What's that about vegetables? Hasn't it been a good year for vegetables? Well, near as I can find out, the reason for food scarcity is that nobody wants to work as hard as they used to. Women don't want to make butter anymore. If we let them get away with that, next thing you know, they're going to want bodily autonomy. What with all the mines shut down, what will we do for coal next winter? It's becoming mighty apparent that nobody wants to work these hard times.